What's going on guys and welcome to episode 3 of part 2 of this Pokemon Shield Wonderlock Challenge. In the last episode, we started our uh, wonder trading, so to speak. We got our numbers. Our Rookity is 6 wonder trades. Our Sobble is 1 wonder trade. And our Squarvit is 3 wonder trades apiece. So, with that being said, we started our quest for our first Pokemon, and we traded the Rookity right here, boing, for, I don't know what this is, I'll be honest, and it's in Japanese, so I really don't know what this is, but it doesn't matter what it is because it cannot stay on the team, indeedy. Psychic Normal. That actually would not have been a bad Pokemon. But, like I said, can't be here. So, it will be up for trade once again. In a minute. So, and, and, and again, since... I, I want to say something real quick. I know I'm stuttering... A little bit, but I want to see one thing. So I still can't do that. Okay, let's run back. Put Squavit into the uh, party, so to say. And let's go ahead and trade off the easiest member of our team to trade off. Which is the Sobble. And let's wonder trade the Sobble off. By keeping Swarvit there. Now let's connect to the internet. And let's get this timer going. Okay, now that we are connected to the internet, timer is going on. We can go ahead and advance to where we need to be. As soon as I say that this is what I wanted. <laughs> yes. Okay. So with that being said, now we have to go back to the wild area station as we are looking to surprise trade. And we can catch more Pokemon here. We just have to be very, very careful with it. Look at that. That's Motostoke off that way. And between there and here are countless new Pokemons waiting to be met. Oh, hello, and if it isn't Sonia. My gran gave me a proper earful on the way. Those two young trainers are settling out on, the, on a journey, but what are you doing with your life? Ah, uh, never mind that. Nothing to worry about yourselves over. Besides, I've been quite curious about that Pokemon you two met in the forest. I've been thinking that I should look into it, so the timing works out fine. If I, if I discover something really huge, maybe Grand will admit that I got some talent. Yikes. Being an adult on its own has its own challenges, eh? I said you didn't need to worry about it. I'm glad to be on the road. Really, it's been ages. It'll be great fun. Fishing camp... To fish and camp and get rough and, and rough it on the outside again. Wow, I can read today. Well, I'm off to stick my head in as many of those red glowing dens as I can find. I'm going to battle all the snot out of a bunch of Dynamax Mons and fill another page in the table of my legend. What is it with him and legends? I, I don't know. What cheat? Dynamax Pokemon are really another level, you know. You should you better Dynamax your partner's Pokemon too if you want to 
take on opponents that strong. You'll find a spot here and there in the wild areas that emit red beams of light. If you think you're up to it, check them out, and there'll be Dynamax Pokemon lurking in inside. So with that, how about I send you off with a treat for me? Okay, there's what I was looking for, was the box link. Okay. Put the box link in the key his bag. Okay. With the Pokemon box link, you'll be able to put your Pokemon in from your team into boxes, or take Pokemon from your boxes to add them to your team. Nice, right? Go, So go wild catching as many Pokemon as you'd like, and fill in some more of your Pokedex. The wild area is waiting for you. This is the start of a real adventure. Okay, with all that dialogue, I need to take a sip of drink. Okay. Yes, yes, I, I, I see where I need to go. That being said, Rolling Fields, a new area that we can catch a Pokemon in. And our trade is complete before we even get a chance to catch a Pokemon. So, this is going to be our first official team member. Goodbye, Sobble. Hello, Galarian Ponyta. Alright, now one thing that I forgot to mention in the first couple of videos is if this level is too high, we can wonder trade it back off. So let's just see what this is. Surprise trade. Let's see what level this is. It's level one. So Ponyta will be in our team officially. Now, with that being said, let's add it to the squad. Uh -huh. Alright, that was the button I was looking for, not R2. And let's start our second trade for the uh, rookie that we caught earlier. Because we still, since Ponyta is only level 1, we still have to wait a while before it can, you know, be viable. Uh, and with that being said, we can't be keep continuously running from Mons, uh, because then it's not viability. With that being said, so Squarvit will be our leader here from now on. And we are searching for... Pokemon number two. Yeah, okay, let's do this. Exempt. Oh, Bumblebee. Oh, why, oh, why? Let's hope that this Bumblebee can be caught relatively easily. One. Mud slap. Let's see how much this does. One, two, okay. Okay, okay, okay. We're good, we're good, we're good. Uh, so we can actually bite here. Mud slap. How is it faster than this? Still does two. Accuracy fell. Use bite. Avoided the attack. Oh, here we go. Defense fell. Bite. And avoiding the attack. Uh, let's try this Pokeball here. One, two, three. Oh! Why? So close. It's not hurting us that much, but it is being a pain in the tuchus. Here we go. One, two, Three. There it is. There we go. We caught Bunnelby. All right. Now we can actually start Wonder Training Squirrel Elf if we want to. All right. And Ponyta grins, gains to level four. Special attack. All right. A physical attacking Ponyta with the special. Not that bad. Okay. With that being said, Bunnelby. Now we have to figure something out with you, my good, dear man. Okay, Google. Pick a number between 1 and 6. Here's your 
Choose a random number. Four. Okay, so Bumblebee will be tr wonder traded off four times. Let's make sure we write that down. Okay. With that being said, and let's cross off the starter. We can start going again. Nickname. Excuse me. And again, nickname for this run through is Surprise Trade Nap Town. All right. So, still keeps a little bit of protection for uh, the Galarian Ponyta, who's our only official team member. But for now, let's trade away this Pokemon, and we get a Magic Card. Okay, so that's two trades now. Still need four more to go. Magic carp, yada yada yada. And let's go ahead. Surprise trade. Magic carp. Send that off. Yes, let's go ahead and save our game. Because we are. looking. And I did say in my last episode uh, that we were going to stick our head into a couple of dens here. Okay, here's trade number three. These trades are happening a lot faster than they did last time around. Okay, goodbye Magic Card. And hello Hootoot. So there's trade number three. And let's do trade number four right now. As I keep waiting, uh, let's go ahead and make our way over to before that ninja ask West Lake Axelwell and let's go over here I, I see that the trade's completed I just want to see what's in this den first and 300 watts water ground Alright, so we're going to pause the timer here and just wait for some people, I guess, to show up. I'm also trying to back out, so. Okay, never mind. We're in. And this will count as this area's uh, Pokemon. A whooper. So let's get the score of it out. And even though we don't know how to Dynamax, let's Dynamax and do the darkness. I actually haven't seen Dynamax School of it yet, so let's see this. Oh, cute. It's a cutie. So, with that being said, we have to be very, very careful. If he uses Helping Hand, Magikarp use Tackle. We'll use Max Strike. 
And goodbye, Eevee. Oh, I held on with Focus Sash. Speed fell. I'm using Max Darkness. Let's see what this does. So let's get out of here. Not worth it. Kidding me? So, this might take a while. <laughs> So, on my last one, let's go ahead and do Max Darkness again. Tackle does nothing. Max Darkness does a little bit, but not much. Notified all stat changes. And then Max Strike on the Snorlax. Goodbye, Snorlax. So, with Snorlax incapacitated for a couple of turns, I have to be very, very careful. As I use Bite, Mud Shot. Okay. Um. I'm going to heal here. Can I not heal? So as I heal here, uh, I'm just hoping to not die. Slam on Magikarp. Magikarp holds on with Focus Sash. Tackle. Stopping tantrum. Okay. That does nothing. Try to use bite, I guess. It's gonna help magic card. Who uses flail? Mud shot. Okay, survive that a little bit better. Snorlax uses body slam. And I'll use bite. And now I gotta heal again. So, even though this is taking a while, I think it will be worth it in the long run if we can keep up, this up, but also have to keep in mind that water going on Eevee, there goes Eevee, okay. Growing even stronger now. Uh, so we probably have only a couple more turns left. Uh, Hydro Pump actually hits. It's neutral. Stats go unchanged, which is good. Mud Shot on the Magic Carp, which, you know, he already got his attack off, so that's not terrible. Storm's getting too strong to withstand. I use Bite. And he uses Body Slam. Now if we can just have one, one more attacker. 
come out here. If I had quick attack, I would use it here. Because then we... Yes! 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 And we will go ahead and catch the whooper. Dynamaxing whooper, that is something else. But it is good for us. And whooper will now be part of the wonder trading. Okay, Google. Pick a number between one and six. Okay, and Whooper will be traded off one time. So that's not a bad scenario either. As we continue our route here, Whooper will be added to the Pokedex. Yes. S T. And now we can continue on. party, but what I will really do is Pokemon box. Oh, that was a level 20. That's why it took a while. <laughs> okay, so we are on trade four for the Rookity. So we still got to trade it two more times. So we cannot keep Score bunny would be so good right now. Ah! Still gotta trade this off. Crapper. Uh, let's go ahead and trade off the whooper. Just, just to get the whooper trade done and over with. So let's get that one done and over with and have another Pokemon on our team as we continue our movement here. Let's get out of this place. It's raining. Yes, thank you. We got away safely. So, with that being said, we got Why? Why Pelipper? Uh, let's run. Run. Couldn't get away. Okay, this should not... I was gonna say, if this... If we died there, that should not count. But we got away, so... As we continue our search... Now, Rolling Fields, another chance for a wild area. But first, our newest member of the team is... Vanillish. Okay, um... Vanillite, sorry. Um... Not bad for the first gym. Let's just see what level it's at. Level 26. I don't think it will listen to me, though. That's the problem. So we will wonder trade this back off. And we will continue our route here. So, Diglets. And I see a combi. <laughs> I'm going to trade off this combi real fast. <laughs> well, combi. Uh, let's do that. Okay. Level 7 combi. A 1. A 2. A 3. Oh, no 3. Use gusts. And again, we're normal, so we'll, we'll eat that. No! 
Oh, thank goodness. I hit run back. I misclicked. Let's bite. Use gust. That does four. Bite weakens it down. Now let's throw the Pokeball. Yes, okay, we got him. Okay. As we continue our track here, Ponyta grows to level five. Ponyta learns Tail Whip. Okay, and we have Combi. And yes, we will trade our nickname Combi. Okay, Google. Pick a number between one and six. Okay. So, Combi will be traded off four times. Let me write that down. So, let's continue to Motorstoke. As soon as we do this. And boing. Riolu. Okay, so we potentially have Riolu here. Which is not great, but it's not bad. Mm -hmm. If this Riolu is under level 20, it is on the squad. And it is, so. Let's start. Trade number five for this score, Bunny. Alright. And let's go ahead and get Riolu starting to level up. Uh, and let's go ahead and move the combi over and let's take this and put it into our bag hold on I don't put it into your bag thank you score or bombi so we gotten two members of our team Uploaded in Dappled Grove. Again, another chance for some Peckerhose. But first, let's trade this score bunny off. This is trade number five. One more trade, and then we keep whoever we trade for. We trade something good in the first gem for something good in the second gem. And we can't keep him. We can't keep him. Yapper. So let's trade off Yamper and let's get the Pokemon that we need. And let's add that to the team. In the meantime, let's make our way closer and closer to Motorstoke. And again, I, I said this a couple times ago. Uh, I, I can see where the glitchiness of this is, and let's see who we have to add to our squad. Bye, Yamper. I wish I could keep you. Yamper goes boing. Please be 20 and under. Please be 20 and under. Please be 20 and under. I saw one of these. My friend told me one of them. Yes! 
Dreepy! Yes! Okay. We are going to be severely underleveled going into this gym. But, it's okay. Um, so let's get Dreepy onto the squad. And let's go ahead and move him over because he's the next lowest one. So, Rookity and the Starter and Whooper are all on the squad officially. So we have half of the team right now. Not necessarily good, not necessarily bad, but let's go ahead keep Ponyta underneath here. Let's see what these are, actually. Let's see what attacks these guys know. And I'll have to be start thinking about uh, names for these guys. So it has up speed, up sp or down special defense, I think. Uh, tackle, growl, tail whip. This has quick attack, indoor, bullet punch, high jump kick. That's going to be tough to level up just because uh, it's by friendship. Steadfast. Uh, determination boost speed at each time the Pokemon flinches. Okay. And then finally, Dreepy, Infestation, Quick Attack, Bite, and Confuse Wet Ray. So it does have... Stab, kind of. Not really. But, okay. With that being said... Um, let's get out of here. Only because we need to grind a little bit more. And I think I might have taken a long way around. I'm not 100% sure. But let's go ahead and put... Squirm it out onto the Wonder Trading Block. And let's, so we have at least two areas that we can still get Pokemon from, if we feel like it. Trade number one. And I'm sorry, that would actually be really good if it was not as overleveled as I know it is. That's going to be doing it for this episode. Um, I will go ahead and continue to keep this rolling until we get our fourth member of the team. Uh, with that being said, though, that's going to be time. And, uh, yeah, uh, I'll go ahead and do some grinding off screen. Butterfree, let's let's fight this Butterfree. Butterfree. How do I get noticed by the by the flying Pokemon? Here. Ooh, Growlithe. Let me fight the Growlithe. Growlithe is one of my favorite Pokemon, but I also know I need experience, and I have Bonaldi here who has stab. Oh, this might actually be bad for me. Level 15, Mud Slap. Let's see what this does. Flame Wheel. Uh, what now? Um. Okay. Figure that's what you have. Um. So we can't catch anything on that route, and now I think we just lost, uh, I think we just lost a trade, because I was being dumb. Let's 
two. Quorum Knight, that would have been a bad Pokemon here. So. Let me start this long trek back. Okay, yeah, that would have been not worth it. Uh, because Quorum Knight would have listened. To the Growlithe, they say, it's, you have stabbed, they said. Now I don't know if I actually have a Pokemon. You know what? That's not gonna... Okay. Let's wrap it up here. Corb Knight, you're gonna be traded off for... An Navy. Great. Not that I don't love Eevee. It's just with how my team is right now, it's not the greatest thing that I can see. Alright, well, that's going to do for this episode, everybody. In the next episode, I will be doing some off-camera grinding and get everybody leveled up to level... Let's say level 11 or so. Yeah, that should do it. Level 11. Anyway, guys, till next time, peace.